Planet Surfer is a large helium airship with an internal aluminum wire frame to strengthen the ship to handle a vacuum environment. The dimensions of the orbital airship is 105 meters by 179 meters by 10 to 41 meters with a cubic volume of 475,168 cubic meters and a surface area of 47,857 square meters. We will be using a new Kevlar Exo material, giving it a weight of 11,340 kilograms, and attached to the lower section will be a flexible heat shield of woven ceramic and silicon carbide yarn, adding 6,350 kilograms of weight. A series of cold gas thrusters will allow for high altitude and vacuum control. It will have five small RP-1 engines, producing up to 2,500 kilograms of force combined. Fuel tanks will carry 50,000 kilograms of LOX and 23,000 kilograms of RP-1. The Planet Surfer orbital airship will gradually gain altitude to the height of 11 kilometers. Onboard heaters and pumps will control the temperature and density of the helium as the airship rises. The engines will ignite, burning 4 kilograms of RP-1 per second, and will slowly increase speed up to 28,000 kph while using its lifting body to slowly rise out of Earth's atmosphere. Once in orbit, the access hatch at the top of the vehicle will open and the payload will gently be released. The Planet Surfer will then perform a flip maneuver and fire its engine to slow velocity and then flip again to begin aero braking into Earth's atmosphere. As it descends toward its landing area, a drone will connect to it and tow it to port. Helium will be produced from old gas wells that are no longer producing enough natural gas for commercial production. Current payload capacity is at 12,000 kilograms. Planet Surfer represents a new path to orbit.